guys, welcome back to my channel. I have a Ray Dunn haul today, and I also picked up some pretty flowers. Is everybody excited that we're getting closer to spring? It's been in the 50s today. It is quite windy, but it is a beautiful day, a lot of sunshine. So I picked up some flowers from my giant, and I'm going to put them in my uh, drink pitcher. But I spent the day Ray Dunn hunting wasn't originally planning on doing that, but I was helping out a buddy, um, a subscriber and buddy friend, Jessica. She reached out to someone through uh, Facebook and purchased two bowls. So I told her I'd go ahead and pick those up for her today. Um, so this morning I headed out to our TJ Maxx Home Goods combo store. And to my surprise, there was five or six ladies already standing out at the front door with, I mean, it was like a club meeting. Um, they had a tray of Starbucks coffee with them um, and passing it around. And I felt like the odd man out. And I was waiting for the lady to, to pull up and, and, and come up to the door that I was picking the bowls up from. And she did. And, and I grabbed this from her. And I'm like, well, since I'm here, I might as well go in. I wasn't planning really on shopping this weekend. So I went into that combination store and they had nothing. So, and those ladies, they ran, they were taking that seriously. I said, you know, I was here a couple weeks ago and they opened the TJ Maxx side before the home goods side. And I think they felt like I was trying to get them away from the home goods side and, you know, get into the store first. And I'm like, it's really not this serious. Um, and when the doors open, they did run. Like, I've never seen anyone run. They had a plan. They, two or three ladies were going to the left. Two or three ladies were going straight back. So I've heard all the stories on YouTube. I've never really witnessed it or been a part of it. Um, and so they went on their ways. And there really was uh, nothing. I think one lady found Prince and Princess, uh, a mug set, but... So let me share with you what I did find today. If you can tell by the, the title, For Paws Only, I found a lot of stuff from my mom's dog. And I was excited about these finds. So I started out with Home Goods, TJ Maxx, didn't find anything there. And I'm like, you know what? Let me go looking around at some other places. Um, stopped at, where did I go to from there? I'm trying to think out loud. Stopped at another Home Goods. So I've been to one, two other home goods, two other home goods, and a TJ Maxx today, and a Marshalls. Marshalls is where I found a lot of stuff. And don't, let me not uh, forget to tell you, I did go out to Home Goods and HomeSense last night, but Marshalls is where I found some adorable stuff. Starting with Good Dog. And I love the detail on the lid. So I wanted to pick up both of them. They had good dog and they had dog treats. And these were only $12.99, which is a really good deal because I feel like the human canisters are like more expensive for the same size. And even with that, that detail there. So this guy was $12.99. They had another one like that um, with the same kind of lid uh, that said dog treats. So I picked that up at Marshall's. I really, I really did, I did really well today at Marshall's actually, as you'll see, or so I feel like I did. So I picked that guy up for my mom's puppy. So I guess he would be like my furry brother, my fur brother. Um, and then I also picked up this for him. I picked this up last night at my home goods, Live, Love, Bark. It's so cute because he loves to bark. So this was just perfect for him. I think I saw this in someone else's haul. And when I saw the Live, Love, Bark, I'm like, this is perfect for my mom's dog. She has a, a Sheltie and he's seven years old, but he still thinks he's a puppy and still carries on as if he is. Um, so this is perfect for him. This little guy, I think it's just $9.99. One-handed, watch me drop something. Yeah, this little guy was $9.99. And I mean, look at, look at the size of that. 
there's more detail in the writing, but yet we pay $9.99 for the sugar. I think the tea I got for like $7.99, like the small sugar, the small tea. But love that. And what I find with the dog stuff is it's just like, it's like sitting there. It's like no one really is bothering with it. It's just right there. And so, of course, I had to pick up Wolf. Now, I know these have been out for a while. I really thought that I had bought this already for my mom. Look at the dimples on that guy. So this might have been a return. Look at those dimples. And this guy was $9.99. And I really thought I had bought this already. He does have puppy love. And the one that you saw in a previous haul. Oh, I'm trying to think of what that one said. I'd have to go back and actually look. But I picked up Wolf. I picked this up at um, TJ Maxx. So I did go into TJ Maxx uh, today. So those are my um, Fur Brothers three canisters. It's, it's more fun for me to buy canisters for the dog for my mom instead of buying basically the same canisters that I have for myself because I don't know if my, my parents would really use them. So it's kind of more fun to buy... Um, all these canisters for dog treats because you know he loves his dog treats but I just love it look at the detail like that just those letters just look like they pop right off and the dimples I bet this was a return because I've never seen anything with so many dimples and then that that little uh, top so that was Marshall's Wolf was at TJ Maxx and this little guy was at Home Goods last night so where else did I go? Oh, and then I went into HomeSense last night and got Girl Boss. Love it. HomeSense really doesn't have a lot. I've found a couple things here or there, but they really don't have a lot of, like, oh my gosh, Ray Dunn items. And then, let's see, also in Marshalls, let me show this to you. It's so cute, isn't it? It says, for peeps' sake... So I put my little peeps in there. Isn't that cute? It's more difficult than I thought it was going to be to wrap them around there. And now I don't have any peeps left. And I'm not going to eat them out of here. I didn't wash this because after I tried to open it. And this literally, when it when I opened it, it kind of like popped my hand when it, when it, when it released. I'm like, yeah, we won't actually be going in and out of this. This is going to be for decoration. This is only $3.99. And it's just so cute. So I got that at Marshall's also today. Um, let's see, what else did I get at Marshall's? I'm going to save kind of the, there's one item that is kind of a unicorn. I'm glad I found it. I think it's like a seasonal unicorn. It's not the jelly beans. Um, what else did I get? So I got Sleepy. I got that at Marshall's today. I think I'm kind of showing you uh, what I'm talking about, my little unicorn there. And I got caffeine. I think this one I got at HomeSense today. I went in there. They just opened a, is it Sierra Trading Post, which is part of the TJ Maxx family. They just opened one of those today right next to HomeSense and HomeGoods. So it was pretty busy, a lot going on, so I, I did go back in there again today. Oh, also at Home Goods earlier, I picked these little guys up. And I picked them up because they were on the clearance rack. They're stemless wine glasses. They were on the clearance rack. Look at that price. $4. I don't understand. I hope they're like, I mean, they don't look broke. I don't understand why they were on clearance. And there was more up by the register that weren't on clearance. So, I don't know, maybe somebody just got happy with the... Clarence gun, but that was a good deal. That's the only reason I picked them up because they were half price. So yes, this is my seasonal unicorn. I got the Happy Spring canister and there was actually um, a couple at the Marshalls. So Marshalls really, I was really impressed with what they had today. They had three of the Happy Spring um, canisters. Uh, they had two or three of the Happy Spring Crocs and they had some flower canisters, so I was excited to find this. And this little guy um, was $19.99. That's what I'm saying. And I know I'm not the first to say this, but sometimes the pricing on this, it's like, it really doesn't make sense. 
but I was happy to find that because I do have the Happy Spring Crock and I do have the Happy Spring uh, Cake Stand, so that kind of completes that. Oh, also last night at Home Goods, I picked up a couple more of the pasta bowls, and these are $7.99. I love these. Um, they both, I just picked up family. They had family blessed, and then I think like one or one, maybe one tasty. Um, so I picked up two of the family. I have two that say more, please. We love these. We eat spaghetti sometimes like once a week. Um, so these are perfect. We eat a lot of rice and bean dishes too, and so... We love these, so I have four now. It's me and my three daughters, so it's perfect. We have a set. Also at Home Goods last night, I did pick up Good Egg and Bad Egg, and that was $9.99. So I have, as far as Easter canisters go, I have the, um, as far as Long Letter, I have Happy Spring, and I have, if you can see over there, the Good Egg. Not the good egg, just the good egg, but yeah. And that, the good egg is where I told you where I went into that TJ Maxx Home Goods combo store and how I felt like this lady was like right up on me. Um, that was the same store I went to this morning where I, I really didn't realize that people do run through the aisles to get to the back after the doors open. So I did get good egg, bad egg, and then I found this at HomeSense today. And just Happy Easter, and it's got the little bunny rabbits on it that go with all of my bunny rabbit pieces. And this was $14.99, so I think that's a good price. I like how it's um, curved. It's not straight across. It's not like a perfect square. So I thought that was adorable. And I finally broke down and picked these up because, you know, that way I have all the basics. Maybe. So I'm going to take these out and I think I'm going to put them in my little um, pour. I just have to find it. The, you know, the little creamer that says pour. I was able to actually find my mom um, the long letter cream and long letter sugar bowl today. So she'll have those. So I'm going to take these out and put them up. And I'm going to put my flowers in my little pitcher there that's not new. Um, and then probably see if I can find a home for the rest of this stuff. It's getting crazy. I'll put these three away for my mom. She can pick them up, but I think I'm done. We need to be done. Like, I mean, I would love one of the new birdhouses, but see, when I say I'm not gonna go out, I end up going out and buying more Ray Dunn. Thanks for watching. Have a good weekend.